Hey everyone, and welcome back to my playthrough of Death's Door. For anyone new, all footage is from a live stream playthrough on Twitch and YouTube, but it's broken up into some smaller parts instead of the full VODs. If you want to see more content in this format, please let me know down in the comments, and uh, I'll catch you all at the end of the video. With ASIO might be, like with you, Ruru, being an agent of ASIO. Is that what we're blowing your coffee for? <laughs> so those don't necessarily count as shiny things. Oh, we also need to go back to Steadhone as well. Ah, okay. So there's three more of those to find. So we open the big boy gate. Let's go to Steadhone. You know, I'm a little sad the music's no longer playing in here. Gonna admit. Make your own music. I... I can't do that. No owls. Where'd you go? We got a regular Houdini now. Where'd he run off to? Oh wait, he's in here. Oh, so that's probably what's in the mausoleum. Hello again, Reaper. For some reason, I stirred from my usual resting place tonight. I could feel something calling out to me. Hmm. Oh? You found my old locket? Hmm. I haven't seen that since... Hmm. Since the day I buried my only friend. The day the ground shook and the sky turned black. I feel... So strange. We did make him say I wasn't I wasn't my intent. Okay. AoE. Understood. Did you just block that? He didn't block the fire. Yeah, he can't block fire. Not that anybody normal can, but... Oh, now he pissed him off. Oh my god. Alright, let's, uh, let's, let's line him up. Oh, he almost rolled into the other one. It's fine. Burn him. Let 
Let the fire do the work at this point. He's not dead yet. Never mind. Oh, wait, we did we actually killed him? Thank you, Reaper. My time in this world is over. Oh. Well, thanks a lot, guys. You led me into murdering him. Now I have to go to bed with that guilt tonight. Made him sad, me bad, root Chad. <laughs> but dong even. Yeah, we swung the sword. I mean, if you knew about this, then you probably both murdered him first. Just saying. Now that I'm thinking about it. I did the pacifist run. I don't think you did. I am pressing X to doubt on that there's a pacifist run through this game. I he killed me lots. <laughs> he wasn't too bad. His his movements were fairly predictable and he didn't really have any gimmicky attacks. So four shiny things left. Maybe we'll go see Jefferson again. Maybe he's got some new intel. The last piece of information he gave us is that... Uh, there was... Um, what she calls it? We needed to fire an arrow through a stone archway. Look at this sleepy fuck. This guy's just drunk off his ass. Sleepy squid boy. Ted? Teddy, is that you? Oh, oh no! You caught me with my two-legged trousers down, so to speak. Yes, that's right. I'm not as humanoid as I would let everyone to believe. Please don't tell the others. Perhaps it could be our secret. Though I hope you're better at keeping secrets than I am. Tell you what, keep this between us, and I can show you the biggest secret of all. Let's go. What? I don't... I didn't consent. He said east? Yep. These guys are bugged out. <laughs> Adventure time? Squid only turn up when there's hentai vibe being. <laughs> they can smell it. Um, I missed where he said to go. I just thought he said east. Every time you roll, he makes noise. Can 
Can I re-trigger the... Hello again, my feathery nocturnal companion. I must say you're still the other night was quite liberating. It's tough keeping such a big secret. Maybe that's why I so rarely spill everyone else's. Let's go for another stroll. Alright, dude, like, let's head east to the domain of the late Frog King. Okay. That I can do. Oh, I can't go in there. I'll have to travel on foot. Those are feet, right? He's got a point. How exciting to be on an adventure. I can feel blood coursing through my appendages. Those two legs of yours get tired. You could take me back to my tank. Oh no. You're telling me to go all the way across the map. We're going. We're going on an adventure. <laughs> hey, phrasing. I have a literal squid with me. There's, there's nothing... There's nothing off limits right now. Well, this is a spooky place. I think I saw a ghost. You did see a ghost. Literally right there. Quite a creepy looking statue. Like, he's riding the line of being annoying. So many graves on there. So tragic. Still, at least I know where to go if I need a wardrobe change. Those ghosts don't hurt. Why are you mean to them? Because I asked them kindly to stop, and they didn't. Also, they kind of creep me out. Eck. Hope you know what you're doing here. Hey. You chose to come with me. Without even a, so much as a second thought. What a lovely night for a romantic gondola ride. Hey now, don't get the wrong idea. Alright, now where do we go? Or do we have to actually go all the way to the, the Frog King's uh, lair? No, not this one.
We just need to get upstairs. And we can't do that from here. Close though. Yeah, we just need to get to the upper level and we're good from there. Oh. Yeah, health is good. Yeah, I know we need to get to the flooded fortress. I just can't remember. Is this upstairs now? Yeah, okay. There we go. I think we can go there from here. You know, somehow we actually routed this properly, for the most part. There was one little hitch in the system, but... We're almost there. Keep your eye membranes over and look for guidance for them the moon. Oh, there was another moon, uh... Yeah, okay. So technically, I didn't even need him to tell me this, but here we are. People clap. Yeah, we did it. We found. We found the next way. Okay, now what? Man, who would have thought this area was so expansive? Nope. Lots of secrets that were left. This game just gives you more. Yeah, you know, this. I was thinking, you know, I, my thought was before I even like went into today's stream was like, okay, if it ends, if I if I end the game tonight, like it would have been, it would have been worth it. It's a little short, but you know, worth it in the end. We're here. I will call upon the spirits to show us their secrets. Spirit of the depths, please show us your treasures. Landwalker. Take this take with you this gift from the depths. May the tendrils of truth guide you in your journey. Well that was a fun adventure, my bipedal companion. If you ever want to go for another evening stroll, you know where to find me. That's right, you better walk back. Or swim back. Excuse me. More bots. And the only thing that sucks is, wait, I was going to say, it's going to suck running back from here, but we don't even have to do that. I don't hear an owl in the area either, so we can do this. Mm -hmm. 
speedrun strats. <laughs> yeah, why did I never realize that before? That makes that makes life so much simpler that you can just save and and bail out like that. Be right back, beer. Question on the game overall. Considering considering what I have in terms of or my the percentage like ninety five or was it ninety four point five completion, is there adequate is there adequate content left in the game to do another stream on it? Or are we kind of at the end of our rope here? Obviously the shiny things and the... Just the umbrella run, really. Hmm. Well, concerning tomorrow's Friday, I mean, we could potentially... I've got a little, little extra time to stream tomorrow as, you know, opposed to what I would normally on, a, you know, a, a night like tonight. Although we're at, we're at four and a half hours at this point, so. We're not talking that much more time investment, but. I was trying to think of, like, how quickly could I umbrella run this game? <laughs> and I'm not, I don't mean, like, true speed run, but I mean, like. Minimal upgrades, just running through, kill whatever I need to, get a couple strength upgrades, and maybe haste or magic or whatever you know suits you know how how the umbrella acts as a as a weapon. Probably two or three hours. Now raining outside of here? Oh, this isn't creepy. Like if you avoid everything and just do boss after boss? We could. That could be a challenge run. Now the question is, are is you know are the are the whispers just ambient noise or are they guiding me somewhere? Do you know how many pots you have left? I don't know. Isn't there a door in the garden we can check on that? Which I guess is outside of this, but... Yeah, we can go look. Yeah, that's, that's way too many whispers for it just to be ambient noise, right? You know, let's let's go outside and find that door first in the garden. <laughs> Yet again, we can't we can't get away from the garden. Yeah, we may very well have collected all of the seeds, but 
Have I deposited them in all the flower pots? Uh, maybe not. All right, we already went around back there. Oh, that. I was like, what is that noise? This is just a shrine, right? Or no, it's not. This is actually the... Big face, I certainly wasn't expecting to see you here, especially at this hour. This is my secret garden. I come here sometimes to tend my flowers and relax. Uh, zero, apparently. Right? Or, no, no, I have to complete the arch, so that's what? One, two, f four? <laughs> I have to say four. So, four, four flower pots left to find... We can do math. <laughs> We're really good at it. And I have no way of knowing. I I, don't, I assume... So how many seeds? I have three seeds and four flower pots. So I'm missing one seed. And... Oh, man. That's going to be a pain. Yeah, we have three <laughs> seeds. So we're just randomly missing one. Well, do those contribute toward Red Door? Um, oh. The trowel is your friend. You're right. But do I have to dive in the menu every time I go into an area? Yes. Ugh. Alright, so it's, is it... Next question, is it per area? So if, I, if there's one in this entire area, this will just glow. Because we can process of elimination that pretty quickly. That wouldn't be too bad. Oh. Come closer. Closer. <laughs> Got him. garden is one house. Yeah, that's what I meant. Like, I can quickly just spam fast travel between everything. To make it less awful. Now, finding the flower pots is you know, another thing entirely. I don't know why I'm hitting crates there. Okay, not glowing, not in the house, not in the main floor of the house. I think Pothead tells you where they are. Not glowing for here. I thought there was a door here. Or is that the inner furnace that only has, is the only one that has, actually has a door? It. 
Wait, what am I doing? I need to use my strat. Screw running around. I'll check with Pothead and again in a moment. Oh. That's glowing, right? That counts? It's got like a nice blue tint to it. How's that for a random... <laughs> I don't even I don't even need to I've apparently I'm a bloodhound for that okay so now we have all the oh you have all the seeds that we need <laughs> we just have to find the freaking flower pots which unfortunately means we have to search the entire area oh not this room At least give me my knockoff Stranger Things music. No, no. You die now. You're not sure the trial shows you the pots as well? It probably doesn't. That would be too nice. Okay, that was that was pointless. That would be way too simple if it actually showed us where I could look that up though. I wouldn't feel I would not feel guilty looking for or trowel shell seeds. The pot hints are given by pothead. Okay. So. The estate. Or is he closer to the entrance to the ceramic manor? Eh. Whatever. I know it's generally up and left, so shouldn't be that hard. I just can't remember if it's on this side or the other. I want to say it's the next. I'm gonna. <laughs> I know we've beaten the dead horse if there's no map, but still. You know, hopefully, uh, if there's not already, I'm sure there's probably community around this game that's made the maps. Yeah, give me map, please. Map mod? That would be awesome.
It doesn't even have to be like a good map either. It's just, just something. Have you managed to grow any more seeds in pots I left around? By recommending, there are four still pots with nothing with nothing growing in them. Try looking around the overgrown rudens the east. Okay. No go to a council pleb like me. This is true and unfortunate. So we have to go find a flower pot in the most convoluted area. Alright, overgrown roots. Please just be, like, right here. Although there's technically four total that we need to get, so not in here. Well, where's the... where's the... the what am I trying to say? Where did they draw the line for the mushroom dungeon? Because that is... I thought that's this. Yeah, okay. So, this is the Mushroom Dungeon, so we don't need to go any further in here. Any of the little kind of alcove areas. Nothing there. I got that one. Oops. Helps if we look. So at this rate, just randomly running around, I'll have enough, um... I'll have enough currency to get uh, the rest of my skills up. Although they're 1500 a pop, so we'd probably have to go through some sort of, like, dedicated farming for that. If I were a flower pot, where would I be? I wouldn't be that close together either. Oh, hey. You throw more things at me, the more the more that are coming back. And that's where you failed. Does anybody have any flower pots here? The funny thing is I probably passed it. Oh well. It's unfortunate because I was thinking that those would be scarce. I know after a little bit Craft, you said they were generous. You got the one near the shrine? Uh, I did. There was one near the magic shrine, yeah. One. 
Okay, there should be two. There should be two near vines that go up. Yeah, there. Well, this one was near a shrine as well. So that's the one near vines. Or we're talking about if that, that's what you mean. The other part of it is, I don't know if Pothead would have told us if there were multiple or not. I could go back to him and confirm. But it could very well be that we got everything here. see anything up there. There's also one near a big flower and some boxes. Well, I may have broken all the boxes. Yep, got that one too. It, it may just be easier or simpler to... to go back to Pothead and be like... and confirm. So west side near the shrine. The red one, I, I, yeah, I did get that one. Yeah, the magic shrine, is that's the first one I was talking about. So uh, the one that is you know down and left of this, I did get as well. Okay, is that four? Uh, we planted one. There's one in the west. There's one near the boxes. Counting hurts. Uh, indeed, it does. And I think there might have been one near the uh, entrance, too. I believe that makes four. And the fact that there's no red glow anymore kind of confirms that. Back to Pothead. Three left then, baby. Yeah, we did it. Appreciate it, Craft. More helpful than you know. Castle Lockstone next. Gosh, I could have saved myself so much time had I realized that you could do that. It does say that, you know, it, it saves. Alright, got the entrance one. Let's just start on the left side and... and try and run off the edge. Oh. 
from there. Nothing here. That's our birdie friend. That's the entrance. There's definitely not one in here. I believe there's one in there was one in this open area that I already got. Yep, there's two. There's three. Trying to think, would they have multiple in the same area like that? Oh. Oh, whoops. So there's got to be, like, one left. And it's probably not even in this sector of the castle. West, right? I I had three, so I yeah, I did check the west first, if that's what you're asking. So I found one at the entrance, and then I just found two when I went like the leftmost path, or the westernmost path. Yeah, I do. Hold on. Uh, no, that's that's not right. Or is it? Got the one in the top right, second floor. I don't need to go in here at all. We'll try top right. This is we do have the handy ladder up here. Do you have the one second floor top right entrance in a hole in the wall? And by right, I mean left. Of course, I mean left. I want to say that I did, but... It wasn't even the one I was trying to hit. in here. Oh, there's one.
Now, the ones that I didn't get are, uh... <laughs> the ones that I didn't get are the ones that I intentionally passed up. They're gonna be in, like, really stupid places. Yeah, that's clear now, too. Yeah, I was intentionally passing up flower pots like an idiot. So it just should be two more, I total. I tried to tell you without telling you. <laughs> yeah, and that's fair. And and I, I do appreciate that. It's just like... My brain was so, so unbelievably stuck on... <laughs> the fact that... Great Cemetery. Uh, I was so stuck on the fact that... Oh, you know, health is scarce. That's okay. That's going to do it for this part. If you're still here, thanks a ton for watching. If you want to see more videos or catch me live, get subscribed here on YouTube or head over to Twitch. All the links for my channels and social media are in the description. Last but not least, I hope you have a good day or night, and I will see you all later.